There's always seemed to be folks who need to say something good, even at the worst of times. Like Mrs. Custer might have said, well, you know, on the bright side, at least he was wearing clean undies. Well, in the spring gather, we went out to find a 300-pound steer that had evaded us. We named him Rompy. We never found him that day, but we did discover a leak in the water line, which, on the bright side, made the ride worth it. Well, the next day we went out early and found him with some cows. All went well and we sorted him off and hauled him to the headquarters here to hold him overnight for the sale the next day. Pretty good morning, I was thinking, by gosh. And then Rompy came unglued. He could see daylight through this pipe gate and into the loading alley. He took four runs at it and I ran around the front to frighten him back and it didn't work and on his fifth try he crashed over the top. I dove out of the way and I looked back as he sailed over me, over my shoulder and I remember thinking, this must be what a torpedo looks like when it's leaving the submarine. Well, we finally got him caught again and hogtied, but where we were was unreachable by a trailer. So I rode back here with my horse and left him and got the pickup, and I went back down to get the boys and Rompy. Well, he was too heavy to lift and he was still on the fight. So after much cowboy cogitation, we took two eight foot two by 12s and laid a ramp from the tailgate down to Rompy. Well, we tried to push him up those boards, but he didn't slide. So I dug through my box of rescue stuff and came up with a come along. We chained it over the gooseneck turnover ball and pulled the cable between the boards and ran it through a soft rope we'd put over the hog tie and began cranking. I pushed and we drug Rompy into the bed of the pickup an inch and a grunt at a time. All three of us looked like we'd been drugged through a knot hole. On the bright side, he could have weighed 500 pounds, or we could have been grape farmers and we'd have never been able to load a 300 pound raisin. <laughs> There's nothing to tie to. This is Baxter Black, from out of his mind, out there.